This is the second part now of uh, Psychiat Sucker Removal or the Pup Removal of Pups. This is where I'm going to show you how to actually remove the, the, the sucker from the mother plant. Uh, we're going to use a trispinosis as an example. And then in the third part, I'm going to show you how we treat the sucker for, uh, to increase the chances of survival. These are, are two trispinosis suckers, which you can see are still attached to the main, the main plant. This is a male, so these will be male. You can see I've opened them up nicely so that I can see what's going on here. These are about 15 centimeters each. Uh, in the process of opening them up, you will damage a few of the roots down here. That's, that, that's, that's inevitable, but the, the uh, most important part here is that you get in between these two suckers like that. You can see this one is starting to move already. And in between the sucker and the mother plant. So that you can gently, without damaging either the suckers or the mother plant, slowly pry the sucker loose. It may be necessary sometimes to use a hammer like this with a spade or something similar to get to separate the, the sucker from the mother plant with minimum damage. So sometimes I just tap the spade like that and then slowly we loosen the sucker. After carefully, you can see the sucker is coming loose now, slowly work all around it. As you work, it'll become more and more loose. You'll see you need to clear the front part because you're going to actually want to bend the sucker down. So you can't have soil here. So you need the sucker to be completely open. Now I've managed to get the sucker nicely loose. I can take it with my hand and I can just snap it off from the mother plant. And there we have it. In part three, I'll show you how to treat this so that we can make sure that it grows.